Hey guys, I'm back with the 14th installment of my 30 Days of Vlogging series. So today I wanted to focus on Jesse Curl products and provide you with a first impression of three products I tried today. The first product is Too Shea Conditioner. The next product is the Aloba Daily Conditioner. And then the last product is the Celebration or I'm sorry, the Jellibration <laughs> spray. All right, so um, Jesse Curl was nice enough to send me a pack of products. They form, uh, they <laughs> have uh, formulated. I can't talk, guys. They formulated especially for fine hair. So I was really, really excited to receive these products because fine hair, and you know, it's always a struggle. Um, to find products that are light enough for your hair, but work really well um, and provide you with the volume and the luscious, you know, luscious curls you want. So I'm very excited about exploring the products. And um, if you check out my Instagram and uh, you can find me at Boldly Blending Out on Instagram, I posted a picture of their product line. And then I also asked the question, which product or which style should I try first utilizing their products. Wash and go, twist out, braid out, flexi rod. What do you guys want to see me do first? And so I've been receiving a lot of wash and go <laughs> replies. So um, if you haven't already, please do visit me on Instagram or check out my Google Plus page or leave a comment below and let me know what style you'd like to see me tackle first using my new Jesse Curl products. All right. So, um, the products I have used, again, are the Touche Conditioner, the Aloba Daily, and then the Gelibration Spray. My hair was kind of dry, and I just used these last night. So this is a wash and go, and this is kind of um, the results of, you know, using the products thus far. You know, this will probably not be how my final wash and go will look because I'm only just learning how to use their product on my hair, right? What products my hair responds best to, which product combinations work best and that kind of thing. So this will not be my um, wash and go video with their products, okay? Um, so I just wanna put that out there. But um, what I did for today's wash and go was I deep conditioned my hair first and I used their Touche conditioner to do that. So I sectioned my hair into three parts and then I used probably nickel size portions of the product, worked it through the hair and then I twisted it and left it in for probably about a half hour or so. And then I went ahead and I did my regular co-wash. Now, when I rinsed out the shoe, the Touche conditioner, I have to tell you that my hair was super soft. Like, it felt really good on my hair going in. Um, but I didn't have any idea how it would feel once I rinsed my hair out. But, my again, my hair felt so, so good. Um, it was extremely soft, and it felt really, really moisturized. So um, I was very pleased with that. Um, so I went ahead and I co-washed, and then um, while I was still in the shower and my hair was still dripping wet, I added the Aloba Daily Conditioner. Um, you can use that as a rinse out conditioner, but you can also use it as a leave in. So I chose to use it as a leave in and I used probably a quarter size amount throughout my head. Um, I went with a smaller amount because again, I'm just growing accustomed to using their product. They seem very moisturizing and it seems that it can have, um, I don't know, I feel like it adds some, I was afraid it would add weight to my hair because of the way the product feels um, in the hand and once you put it on the um, on the hair but um, it actually was not heavy on my hair at all so it's really interesting the way they form you uh, formulate the product but I did add it to my hair and because my hair was wet it spread really easily and I always use a little less product than I normally would anyway if I'm putting it on soaking wet hair so I went ahead and I put that in there and then I used this um, the gelibration spray that's hard to say gelibration spray and um, it is a styler that um, so the aloba daily 
product um, helps, it's supposed to bring out your curls and the Gelibration spray is supposed to further enhance them and then give you a bit more hold. So I did apply that to the hair and then um, I diffused it a little bit and then I let it air dry the rest of the way. First impression was my hair felt super, super, super soft. Every product I put on my hair um, or on my hair contributed to my hair being even more sort of soft, supple, smooth. The strands felt really smooth. Um, and so I was very, very excited about that. Um, and I loved that. In terms of the overall kind of wash and go, I feel like it's it's okay. You know, I'm still getting used to the product, so I'm still playing with it. Um, but I thought it was just okay. Um, it doesn't give me a whole lot of volume, and you guys know I like a whole lot of volume. But my hair doesn't feel weighed down either. So it's not that my hair is um, weighed down by the product because it isn't. It doesn't feel greasy, doesn't feel like there's any residue on your hair, nothing like that, nothing like that. You, as you guys can see, it moves. So it isn't any, you know, it, there's none of that going on, but for some reason, it just doesn't give me the volume I get with some other product combinations. And also the roots of my hair like look different. So I have, you know, and I'm going to post some pictures, I think, on my uh, Facebook page and maybe on Google Plus as well. The definition on the ends of my hair is actually pretty nice. The clumping on the ends of my hair is really nice. I have mostly, like, um, I feel like these are probably my 3B-ish curls, you know, kind of back here. And this is where my hair is finest in the back. Um, but I, I felt like over here, and, you know, it doesn't show up on this camera that well. Again, I'll be using um, another HD camera so you can really see the the hair much more um, clearly. But um, it didn't clump the way I would have wanted it to um, in my roots. And it could be, you know, just about my, my application. So I have to figure out kind of how to apply the product. Um, and so my curls, they just don't have consistency. They look one way up here. <laughs> And then they look a different way on the ends. So, you know, that I am I still have to work on. But aside from that, I mean, very pleased with the product. Very softening. Does exactly what a conditioner, you know, would do. I just, I think that I need to work with the stylers a little bit more to figure out how to make them work best for me. I actually use the Aloba and the gelibration spray on a twist out I did on an old wash and go a couple of days ago and let me tell you the definition was freaking awesome <laughs> I loved I loved it so I cannot wait to do a twist out with um, these products because not only was again the hair soft but I had great twist out definition so looking forward to that so that's my overall interview um, my overall first impression uh, review for the moment I will definitely uh, be coming back with you know the uh, first style hopefully within the next week so you guys please let me know what you'd like to see me accomplish first a wash and go twist out flexi rod set braid out braid and curl twist and curl cocoon curls which I want to see let me me know all right I'll talk to you guys later have a great Sunday bye